What's up? How are you guys this week? Hopefully you're feeling a little better than me because I don't know what they're spraying in the air over here on the East Coast. <laughs> Apparently I did not move far enough away from New York because like my eyes have been just swollen and I can't even breathe and go to sleep. But um, maybe, uh, maybe uh, some of you guys are not as unfortunate. Looks like the uh, delivery for some packages just got here. Chuck's backing up to the dock outside right now. Let me go open up that dock for him. So I wanted to start by reading a review for you guys about the eggs. Hey guys, just wanted to let you all know that I received my order today and all eggs were whole. It was 118 degrees in Phoenix today and you guys nailed it. Thanks again for putting out a superb product. So even in the hotter weather, guys, we're still shipping the eggs just fine. And if you do get any broken eggs, of course, just reach out to us, email us, and we will give you a credit. Uh, but be sure to take a photo of your package. Uh, if you guys weren't signed up for the email list, uh, we did a huge chicken giveaway over the weekend. We gave away over like $3,000 worth of uh, chicken quarters and chicken wings. So about 175 orders got like a free package of each of those. Uh, so hopefully you guys enjoy that this week. And then we did restock all of the corn and soy free chicken. <laughs> And I would say at the most affordable price online, but I looked online yesterday and no one else is really selling corn and soy free chicken, at least that has it in stock. There were like a few farms that had it for pickup and we're actually selling it cheaper delivered to your door than they do when you have to pick it up at the farm. But if you guys are still looking for a deal and want something affordable, we have ground beef on the website now for like six seventy-five dollars a pound for grass-fed, grass-finished ground beef. So that's more of like a budget thing. Of course, we have some more expensive uh, grinds that are like the steak blend, the best burger blend, and all that stuff. But uh, we got a lot of stuff back in stock, especially on the foods. So I'm gonna show you guys that first. So one thing that we haven't had in a while is the meat granola, because you guys weren't too happy about the texture of the meat. But you know, we have a new machine that makes these like little pellets of ground beef that's perfect for the granola. And we have it nicely vacuum sealed here. You guys can see it's the meat with some macadamia nuts, coconut flakes, blueberries, all super high quality organic ingredients. So if you guys haven't tried this, it's one of the highest quality like keto kind of carnivore products on the market and very, very delicious. You'll eat the whole bag if you buy it. So definitely get a few. We have plenty of that for you guys this week. We did have time to make the uh, Tatomi's vegan cookies, both the dark chocolate and the white chocolate. Guys, I, I keep these out of my house because I brought home like four of these or five of these the other day for lunch and I ate all of them at once, which was like, $15 and 2,000 calories worth of cookies. And also, we restocked the quinoa crisp bars and my guys accidentally made the banana rice crisps. So we, we put those on discount because we're not really selling them anymore. But if you guys want some cheap ones, I think these are like less than $2 each. Also restocked all the artichokes. So we got the whole artichokes. We got the artichoke spread. And then we actually have two new products. One is a fig jam. Uh, so this company makes some very high quality like jarred artisanal products. Fig jam, I'm excited to try that. And we also have something that goes with meat that might be good for like tartare. We have these salted mountain capers. I'm excited to try these too, but these will all be listed back on the website today, guys. So a lot of stuff on Frankie's Free Range Foods. We also finally restocked the water kefir. I'll show you guys that in the fridge real quick. Yeah, we have a few cases of just plain water kefir for you guys. While we're in the fridge, I'll show you real quick. You guys bought pretty much all of the prime rib, which is absolutely delicious. Look at that professional temperature. And then we also have the roast beef back in stock, which you guys have been buying a lot of as well. Highest quality, 100% grass fed and cooked to the perfect temperature for you guys, roast beef and prime rib. Now I did the math on the water kefir sales and the water itself costs like $3 a bottle and our labor cost is crazy. So we're, we're charging like $10 a bottle right now for the water kefir. Uh, if it was any less, I just wouldn't do it. So we'll see if you guys want it. If not, we just won't sell water kefir. So we're gonna have to figure that one out because it's really expensive to do all that stuff by hand and have a fresh product with a live bacterial culture. So I don't know, maybe if you guys don't want the $10 bottle of water kefir, we'll have to uh, just sell the grains or something. I don't really know. Because when we were selling it for $8 a bottle, we were actually breaking even, <laughs> which is not good from a business perspective. Yeah, we got all the non-meat orders going out today for you guys. And uh, we sent most of the meat orders yesterday because today's actually Tuesday. We were supposed to get the beef sticks back, but 
uh, the company accidentally send it to our old address and the package isn't there, so hopefully it wasn't stolen. Otherwise, uh, <laughs> goodbye to that business relationship, but uh, we'll see what happened. A few, few, few things happened this week and last week that I'm not too happy about from a business perspective because I'm about to start cutting up cows in a field, to say the least, by my fucking self. Yeah, so also on the foods, uh, we have a slight price reduction on the pemmican. I think it's like three twenty-five a bar now if you buy a pack of 10. But uh, let's go and hop in the freezer and show you guys some stuff. I'm not really dressed for it today, so maybe it'll be quick. One thing we did restock is the chicken broth. And guys, this is by far the highest quality chicken stock on the market. I wouldn't even call it stock because it's so concentrated with flavor. We literally cook the chicken, strain the broth out, and then add more chicken meat and bones and then do it again. So super, super high quality product. I'm very happy about that. This is the uh, chicken we just restocked after the giveaway. So it's packaged a little differently now. The drumsticks are in packs of five. The thighs are in packs of four, and now they are boneless instead of being uh, the whole chicken quarters. The chicken wings are about the same, four wings to a package. The chicken breasts are now portioned individually, and they are boneless, but they still have the skin on. These are very nicely portioned. And then we have the whole chickens over here for you guys. The main difference is uh, we organize them by weight. So now you're not gonna get like a three to four pound chicken. You're gonna be able to choose the specific weight for the price. Yeah, we still have a lot of this plain beef sausage. I might give this away next week since you guys don't really want it. Yeah, the main issue is the Amish butcher that made those sausages for me charged me way too much. So when I have to charge you guys like $12 a pound for the sausages, no one ends up buying it. But we restock just about everything, guys. We have some plank steak over here. We have the thick cut ribeye steaks, picanha steaks, plenty of the more affordable chuck steaks. And this is the uh, this is the 675 a pound ground beef, 100% grass fed, 80/20 ground beef for 675 a pound delivered to your door, kind of unheard of. Here's my uh, milk crate collection that costs more than my car. <laughs> we did restock the canoe cut marrow bones for you guys, also the most affordable online. Yeah, there's still some wagyu steaks over here for you guys, I think. Oh, one pound sirloin steaks. We used to sell these in half pound smaller portions, but now we got nice thick cut one pound. I actually paid the electrician to replace some of these bulbs because there was no way I was getting on a ladder that high. All right, that's enough of the freezer for today. I think we kind of covered everything. We should be getting in uh, some more meat deliveries this week and next week. Is my camera fogging up? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, so the main thing we're waiting on restocking is some of the glands like the thyroid and adrenal and stuff because I had a supplier that told me they can get them for me and they <laughs> they backed out. So we did like the huge sale to try to move them and uh, didn't work out. All right, I guess moving forward, we're going to have to go in the freezer at the end of the vlogs because I'm not going to sit here for 10 minutes wiping fog off my camera. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're mainly waiting on some glands to restock and, and a few small things here and there. Uh, we might do some more pork sausage. I actually made a new custom Italian spice blend and some custom breakfast sausage blends. But since it is the Iberico pork and it's super expensive, uh, I'm not sure if I really want to do it, but we'll probably do it anyway. Oh man, you know what? This fog is actually suitable because of what they're spraying in the air. So now you guys can kind of get some of the ambiance of how my eyes and my lungs are feeling. <laughs> God help me. Yeah, so a lot of stuff restocked on the foods website, guys, especially the water kefir, which a lot of you have been asking me for. Uh, I'm a little excited. We're supposed to get like a big shipment in from a new supplier for a lot of different stuff on the foods website and the naturals website, but I don't know. <laughs> they said they were supposed to come today, but I honestly wouldn't be surprised if they didn't show up at all. So we'll see. Maybe that'll happen and I'll be showing you guys a lot of new stuff next week. Maybe not, uh, but we'll see. So thank you guys for joining me. If you go to frank you can see all of my businesses, Frankie Strange Meat, Frankie Strange Foods. Uh, we didn't really talk about the other ones today, but we have organ supplements, Wi-Fi shielding, Frankie's Naturals. Uh, still waiting on a, a few things from organ supplements. We might have like one new product in a few weeks and then a bunch of other new products in two or three months. Not really sure yet. 
uh, Wi-Fi shielding. We did restock the bed canopies and the, um, and the mats. Maybe I'll show you guys more of that next week because a lot of you guys have been asking for uh, the bed canopies and the grounding floor mats on Wi-Fi shielding. That's really at Frankie's Naturals, maybe those new products this week. But uh, you guys can, as usual, drop a like on the video, leave me a comment down below, make sure to subscribe and check that notification bell, and I'll see you guys soon. I, I, look, I'm telling you guys, if I had a time machine, I would have just, if I, had a t if I knew the nonsense I was going to have to go through and I had a time machine, I would have just disappeared to Mexico six years ago. But you know the saying, like, you dig the hole too deep, you can't really get out. Thank you.